Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Chunui Food Review. It definitely feels a little bit weird right now because uh, I haven't done a video in the past six months. As you, as you guys have realized, you know, if you guys uh, follow my channel, you do know that my last upload was actually about six to seven months ago, which I just checked a few days ago. So it definitely, uh, definitely feels a little bit weird now doing the video. And I like to take this one minute, like to take this one minute to explain why. Um, I did not do a video for six to seven months, and of course today I'll be doing a video. I'll be reviewing this uh this new salmon burger from Burger King. Um, but before that, let me explain why. So if you are new here or whatsoever, or you don't want to listen to this bull crap, you know you can just fast forward the video by one or minute or so, and where I will start to eat the burger and give you guys the taste of how the burger tastes like. So. Um, as I promised in 2019 that I'll make a lot of videos in 2020, but it didn't happen. I think I made, I think I made zero videos in 2020 until now, which is like October already. Like now it's October where I did my first video right now, which is the Burger King burger, which I mean, which I'm viewing right now. Sorry, you know, it feels a little bit weird, you know. Uh, I mean, I mean, you know, I always do YouTube and script, so it feels a little bit weird right now because uh, I haven't done one video in like, what, six to seven months. Okay, so in 2020, there was this COVID-19 that came about. Uh, which was definitely a little bit uh, inconvenience to everyone, you know. Even McDonald's was closed, okay. But there was only like two to three months of times, and then the other six months I was busy working on my other business, okay. So YouTube, YouTube, I'll con I won't consider it as a business. I'll consider YouTube as a passion, something that I do as a hobby. But I was very busy in my business, and then with the COVID and everything, so I didn't really do a video. But uh, along the way, I received uh not many, okay, a few DMs asking me uh. Uh, we'll review the next burger when they're gonna do a next food review and stuff like that. So, you know, I definitely miss doing YouTube, but uh, I am quite busy with my work lately. But yeah, I'll try my best to upload. Like right now, okay, I won't. Right now, I'm doing this food review shortly. I'll start, okay, and then after that, you know, uh, not sure what's gonna happen after that. You know, maybe after this video, I will definitely, I will definitely upload a video after this video, lah. But uh, not sure when, okay. So the thing is, I'll let them make it clear that I never quit YouTube, okay. Uh, I would, I would call it like taking a break or working on other stuff, busy with other stuff because I'll consider YouTube as a hobby. So when you're busy with your own work, you tend to have lesser time for your hobby, right? But yeah, so since we're here today, okay, let's rewind everything. Okay, so let's go on the food review. All right, so hi. So today, um, as you can see, Burger King, they actually launched this, not say launch, how do I say? It? Yeah, they actually launched this new burger, which is called the Salmon Salmon da, Salmon Delight Burger or something like that. Okay, I'm not too sure. I can't remember about that. So yeah, I was quite disappointed when I received it in a packaging like this because uh I was expecting to receive it in a box. Okay, no complaints though because like uh I'll be honest with you, I don't really eat Burger King. Okay, I'm more towards a McDonald fan, so I always have uh my filet fish and my McSpicy, which I always which is always served in a box. So this is something in a plastic, but. Well, doesn't matter anyway. What matter is what how does it taste like? So let me open it up and show you guys this salmon burger. So wait, let me show you guys it first. Okay, so I actually ordered this from um Great Food. It cost $12.50 excluding delivery. Uh delivery was about four dollars plus. Okay, so total sixteen dollars for this meal, lah, but okay. If I if I had like work to purchase or something, went to went to the nearest Burger King order to purchase, it would be cheaper. Okay, so if I'm not wrong, it's about nine dollars plus for the meal. If when I saw on their Facebook, eight or nine dollars plus for this meal, so it's actually a double salmon. Okay, let me show you guys first. It's actually a double salmon burger. There's some lettuce, um, some vegetables, carrot, carrot and stuff like that on top, and then there's the chicken patty. Uh, <laughs> sorry, the chicken patty. Salmon. There's two salmon patties in the middle. As you can see, can you guys see that? Is it focusing? Yes, it's focusing on the burger. Okay, you guys can see that. Okay, there's actually two salmon burger, two salmon patties, and then also the nacho cheese sauce, as well as the a bun on top, as well as a bun on top. So let me start now by reviewing this burger. Okay, so I have never, I don't think I've tried salmon burger from a fast food chain before. I'm not sure if McDonald had launched one before. I know McDonald did launch this Abby burger, which is the prawn burger, and that was hella good. Okay, that was hella good. I reviewed that. A few years back or something like that, that was hella good. But right now we are gonna review the salmon burger, which I don't think I've tried before, and it's definitely something new from Burger King, nah. Okay, definitely something new from Burger King. So let me get the taste on it and let you guys know how a salmon burger feels like. But before that, let me take a drink. Mm. So I got this apple juice from this apple juice from um I can't tilt my cup, you know, if not the drinks is spillable. 
Got this apple juice from Burger King and it's quite good. It's quite good like a normal Burger King that you, uh, like a normal apple juice that you get from outside. Sorry, I'm just so I'm I'm, I'm feeling a little bit ne nervous and a little bit weird because I haven't done a video in like six seven months. But all right, let's begin by eating this salmon burger. Salmon burger with nacho cheese and stuff like that. Okay, I didn't I didn't uh filter anything you know I just click salmon burger. I never have any special injection extra nacho cheese or whatsoever. So this is as original as you can get. So let me start by eating this burger right now. Hmm. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Just look in the middle. Okay, I'm not sure if you guys can see that. If it's focusing on the burger or not. Yeah, it is now. It's like there's this pinkish thing in the middle and it and it really does taste like fish, okay? It really does taste like fish, okay? Of course it's definitely not like hundred percent just a salmon patty down there. Uh, definitely there's some flouring, there's some flour to it, but okay, this is very good. Mmm. Mmm. Okay, wait. I need my moment to enjoy this. So, they actually added like mayonnaise or something, or tartar sauce. I think it's tartar sauce uh, because uh, when I eat fish and chips, there's this tartar sauce. So, I guess whenever you eat cheese, you have this tartar sauce and it just makes a perfect combo. And it does. The sauce does give it a very good uh, texture. And the burger patty is superb. The burger patty, the fish is very fresh and whatsoever. So I'm not sure if this is the freshest catch of the day because I actually ordered it ordered from Grafford at 11.01 a.m. And Burger can actually start serving lunch, which is this burger at 11 a.m. So yeah, maybe I got the freshest catch of the day. Let me, let me just peel one salmon salmon patty on and show you guys yep so it's just like that it's a salmon patty let me just eat the salmon patty by itself mmm mmm definitely fresh definitely fresh love it so for Mm, grab food, $12.50, I actually did this double salmon burger. I'm not sure if they have it in a single, like, just one patty though, because I never seen that on their Facebook uh, when I was looking through their ads. So, yeah, maybe you can, there's only, there's an uh, option of one patty or two patty, but two patty, go for the two patty. It makes it good. Although I've never tried the first one patty one before, but I'll definitely recommend the two patty one. So for $12.50, you actually get one burger, one fries. Okay, I, I think you can top up like 80 cents for a cheese fries or something like that. Of course, Burger King fries is nice. If you ask me to rank like the top three uh, French fries in uh, of the fast food chain, right? I would say that first is KFC. Their cheese fries is to die for. I mean, it, even their normal fries is nice when it comes to KFC. KFC followed by Burger King, and then maybe you have your Jolly Bee fries. Jolly Bee fries is also very nice. Uh, McDonald fries. If you're asking me about McDonald fries, I would say that it's a little bit soggy at times, and it's not always up to standard, lah. The thing about McDonald fries is that it's not always up to standard, but yeah, it's not bad, I guess. If McDonald had cheese fries, woo, that would be superb. I hope, I guess, maybe. So yeah, twelve dollars fifty cents, one burger, one um, fries, and one drink, which I got the apple juice. Is it worth the price or not? I think if you go and dine nine dollar plus, it's still rather okay because after all. Yeah, I think fish burger. So fish burger, of course, McDonald's sells fish burger for like what two dollars. But okay, if you go and taste, you definitely taste the difference in like the the burger lah. Like you know, if you go and buy a filet fish and eat this, this is definitely much fresher than filet fish, and this and the patty is much thicker, much thicker. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed my video. So I'll give you a nine point ten. Where does the one mark lose to the patty? I mean, the the burger bun is slightly dry, just slightly. If the burger bun was fluffy, I'll give it a 10 point 10. But it's slightly on the drier side, just slightly. So a 9 point 10 is still not bad, especially when the patty is so good. I was expecting to give you I, I bet you were expecting me to give a 10 point 10. But no, I give it a 9 point 10. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed my video today. So sorry for the hiccup. I know that I'm not on my best performance today because I definitely feel a little bit nervous and stuff like that. But yeah, if you do enjoy the video, do give me a like uh, and subscribe to my channel. Go let me know in the comment section what video should I do next. And 
I definitely am not quitting YouTube and I definitely will be doing a video very soon. I hope, okay, I'll definitely find time for my business and everything and school and business and then I'll just find time and then make a food review for you guys. Do let me know in the comment section what video you guys want to see next. Okay, until then, this is Chimney Food Review signing off and see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.